If you do biomechanics work, it's always exciting to get to work with athletes. We've actually worked with sports medicine here at Purdue for almost 10 years, maybe even a little bit longer. You know, Sunday night when we got the call to, to see if there's anything that we could do to help improve the brace and do it while meeting the NCAA's rules, we thought, okay, this, this is something we can do. We talked with the athletic trainers to see what the actual issues were with the brace, with the current brace, and then came up with all the different design goals that we had to meet in order to protect Isaac's elbow. We were doing rapid prototyping, we were making molds, we were trying out uh, interesting padding materials and then testing them and changing them. What finally brought it all together was kind of an old school thing. We actually went back to some leather work because we needed to make sure that he wouldn't be able to lock his elbow out. And since we weren't allowed to use anything rigid, the leather straps and the leather uh, workmanship that one of our students just already knew how to do was fantastic. This is actually kind of the perfect material for this. It was amazing to see all these kind of new and old technologies come together to make a, to make a brace. And I think we actually did a really good job. Working with somebody who's 7'2", uh, presented some interesting challenges. None, we didn't have any models in the lab that, that were the right size. And, and so when we would try to test things out, we would have students, you know, our, our biggest, strongest students, and we would put big bulky sweatshirts over them to see if we could kind of get the fit right. With the, the trial run, it would come all the way up to somebody's shoulder. And then on Isaac, it would be about mid bicep. And uh, so we had, to, we had to do that final fitting to make sure that we were putting the padding in the right place because none of us really could, could approximate um, his arm length. All the, the grad students came together. It was really a wonderful experience to have everybody uh, chipping in and trying different things. But one of the best things about it is the fact that, you know, Isaac and, and Vince and actually the, the whole team are really stand-up guys. The, the, this is a, a wonderful group to work with. So as soon as you meet them and you, and you interact with them, you know that they're, they're very good people. My students and I were really driven to make sure that we, could, we did the best job that we could. Right? So given the time constraints, we, we gave pretty much every hour that we had, we were, we were working on it. And, uh, and it was exciting.